Dallas Control, 254, Goliath Killer, Ghost 2, 1, Barry. You can actually see him right there. Yep, got him. And, uh, got him. In April 2006, members of the Future Combat Systems Program participated in Jeff X06. They demonstrated for the first time the ability to link together in near real time ground sensors, soldiers in the field, and airborne assets to attack and destroy an enemy target. FCS technologies employed for this experiment were ground based unmanned sensors, surrogate command and control vehicles, and the latest System of Systems Common Operating Environment software. Two fields of unmanned ground sensors detected, tracked, and classified ground targets on the test range as a mobile missile battery and a Scud missile launcher were put into motion through the experiment field. The sensors, which can detect both seismic and acoustic signatures, acquired the enemy and instantly relayed the data to the platoon vehicles. FCS software processed and fused the sensor data with other intelligence, including the location of friendly ground forces. This combined data was instantly sent to the command and control vehicle, and then relayed to the Combined Air Operations Center, or CAOC. The CAOC integrated the sensor data with other intelligence, such as information from ground forces, AWACS imagery, satellite weather data, and the location of friendly aircraft. Using this combined information, the CAOC and friendly ground and air assets had a real-time assessment of the threat situation. In the FCS vehicles, the crews were able to monitor the complete progress of the mission to destroy the enemy vehicles. The CAOC determined the available air assets and the tasking order was then sent to the nearest available aircraft. The aircrew acknowledged receipt of the mission profile and acquired the targets. The aircraft rolled onto the targets and scored an electronic direct hit. Jeff X06 provided a boots on the ground opportunity to demonstrate that FCS technologies are maturing on schedule and can be demonstrated in a realistic joint operational environment. The experiment also demonstrated the network-centric capabilities that FCS can bring to the warfighter and joint operations through shared situational awareness and near real-time use of data between ground and air assets. The mission of FCS is to bring the needed capabilities to the 21st century soldier. FCS, one team, the Army, Defense, and Industry.